Good morning, YouTube, featuring Rocky today, this morning. Isn't he so cute? Why so cute, Bubba? Rocky says good, that's better. So, Noha and I went to Potbelly, and we both got the exact same thing, which was the multi-grain chicken breast? Turkey, turkey breast with like mayo, tomatoes, lettuce, and a bunch of other stuff. Let's see who's the cuter eater. Okay. <laughs> um, who eats cuter? Jaja? Or Noha? Or Rocky? Rocky. Rocky's just like there. Hi, Rocky. I hate onions. Staring at you. <laughs> Wait, he's not even peeing. What are you doing? <laughs> are you walking? Are you walking, Rocky? Yeah, I'm walking, Rocky. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. You said park with my family. <laughs> That's what you said on Snapchat. Wait, I can't yeah. see it. <laughs> We're getting ready to film the Q&A and Rocky has us trapped and I don't know where he's at. Where is he? Rocky! Oh, there he is. <laughs> he's, just, he's just there. Whoa! I hope you guys have a great day! We just finished recording our couples Q&A video, so it will be up and ready on Friday. So be on the lookout for that, and it's gonna be great. Let's go see what Noha and Rocky are up to. She's obsessed with Rocky. Aww. <laughs> He's just going in a circle. Oh yeah, today is also workout Wednesday, so we are going Noha, but um, Solo are going to be training some legs, quad focused, and we're going to kind of go over it and explain how we did it, what we did, and how many sets and reps of this and that. So if you're excited for that as I am, you should keep on watching. And um, we are also going to go and have something to eat after. So it's gonna be a cheat meal as well. So I'm ready for this. Are you ready? Let's go. We're gonna. I have. I have flip flops on too. Okay, ready? Okay, ready. We're gonna run. Ready, set, go. Here, lover. Oh, look what Noha gave me. A flower. Bye, Noha. Bye. Come back. Noha's about to leave. Guys, I'm not sure how you guys feel about that, but she's leaving me. Look at Noha. Like, where are they going? Where are you guys going? He loves me. That's not fair. Bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. Do you have to pee? We're in the bathroom. You can go pee. Hmm? I think Rocky's tired. He's had a very long day. He's been at the park. He's been with Noah. He's gotten so much love at school. I bet he's like, I want to go home and take a nap. Right, Rocky? Am I right? Yes, I'm right. And if you guys happen to have a female dog and you guys live in the Dallas Fort Worth area and you want to make babies with Rocky, or if your dog wants to make babies with Rocky, you should um comment down below or something because Rocky is in need of a girlfriend. I repeat, Rocky is in need of a girlfriend. So let me know. You said what? Five minutes? 
You want me to wait five minutes? Yeah. But Lexi gets out in like two minutes. Sparky, tell Ian to hurry up. Work out. Look at his beautiful leggings. Hey, you like those? But I feel like you should have worn shorts. Cause I feel like he's wearing my outfit. I should I be wearing that. My bag. Are you ready for this workout? Oh yeah, I was born ready. That's my line. <laughs> Hey guys! What's up y'all? We did a leg day today, which was quad focused. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it, shall we? <laughs> yeah. So whenever we do a quad focused leg day or a hammy focused leg day, we always try to, so like for an example today, we focused on our quads. So our first two exercises were light hammy exercises. So our two favorite ones that we did was the lying hamstring curl and we did four sets of 15 I believe. Was it 15 or 20? 15. I think it was 15. Yeah, it was 15. We did four sets of or 15 on the lying <laughs> hamstring curl and then we superseded that with our favorite which was the R Romanian deadlift one leg or one leg Romanian deadlift with the dumbbells. and with dumbbells yeah with dumbbells and you have to make sure to keep your core tight when you're doing them because if not you're going to tip over and fall because that's what happened to me at first and then I started getting the hang of it and I actually kept my tour my tour my what my core a little tight and it was a little bit better but yeah, just make sure to keep the core tight. And a lot of people don't do that, right? I feel like I, I see nobody doing the one-legged uh, Romanian deadlift. I'm not sure if you usually see that. Um, do you? Not too often. When I do, I see people do it a lot like on the Smith machine. And I think just because that, yeah, when you yeah. do it with the dumbbells, it does make it a lot harder to, just like you were saying, keep your yeah, core tight. Yeah, keep your core tight. Because I mean, I fail like twice yeah. A few times at least. I saw, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. So if you tip over fall, it's totally fine. Just get your mind right, keep your core tight, and just go for it again. Yeah. Just take promise, it slow. Yeah, I promise it's totally no normal if you like tip over and fall, but just don't die. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but okay, so from there, after we finished our two exercises for our hammies, we went into, we dived into. Right into the quad. The quads. The quadzillas. The quadzillas, yes. And let me tell you, our first exercise for quads, <laughs> we did uh, the the leg, leg press, the, leg, press. The leg, leg extension. extension. Excuse me, I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> we did the um, leg leg press, leg extension. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh, I suck at life. We did leg extensions, but we didn't just do them straight up and down because that's boring, and we wanted to switch it up. So we did ten out, yep. ten in. And then 10 close, yep. like right oh. after the, the other. So awesome. no breaks, no, no, don't stop, keep going. And we also increase the weight, so it does get harder as you go, but don't go too light at the beginning and then end up at a weight where you're okay. You need to like, you need to, what, what are we looking it needs, for? It needs to be heavy from the first set. Yeah. Because if it's not, at least. You want to challenge think. yourself. You don't want to start with super baby weight, like 30 pounds, and then end up with 70 pounds. No. Start at 70 and then just increase by 10 each time. Because it challenged me, too, because I started off with 50 and ended off as my last set with 100. And let me tell you, it was... It was a challenge, but I got through it, and it's all mental. Just just remember that. It is all up here. Yeah. So your mind may tell you, or your body is like, no, I can't do it. It hurts. But your mind, you need to tell your mind, no, you, you got this. I can keep going. And one so. thing with that, if you start too light, I feel like it's a wasted set. It is. So, yeah, exactly, because you're not... You know, you're not you're supposed really to keep doing anything. tension on your quad. If even if it hurts, keep going. So then, so don't take, what do we do? Don't take rest breaks, guys. What do we do that. next? Um, uh, did we let's do front squats? Oh yes, 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 yes. So from <laughs> there, we transitioned into front squats. Oh, front squats. Oh my God, I cannot talk today. <laughs> front squats, and I am not a fan of front squats. I would prefer to back squat but it's good to change it up 
and it's good to you know tell your body hey let's shock your body you know it's good to shock your body yeah. so we the front squats since since today was more quad focused yeah because of where the weight is it's going to focus more on your quads and we did them on the smith machine mm -hmm. um so you can concentrate a lot more on keeping your feet more narrow um which is definitely what we did uh, we weren't supposed to superset these but, but I, sandra hold on. was feeling you know i was feeling great and so motivated and just like <laughs> so i was going beast mode and i got that stool and i brought it over and he was just like what's going on i honestly thought we were that's what the plan even was but we were supposed to it wait wasn't for we were supposed it. to wait but i was like you know what let's just superset it but it wasn't we got it out the way so we did we did um Four sets of 15 on Four front squats. On and then, and let me tell you, or after no, no, we, we did. didn't, no, we, we went up. We went 15, we oh, did 15, two sets of 15, two sets of 15, 12, and then 12, and then 10. And then 10. Yeah, we ended yeah. with 10 sets. And then we did all 10s on the step ups. On the step, and when you're doing the step ups, make sure you're keeping tension on your quad. So as you go up, you don't want to bring your other leg back because you're doing like a kickback, and that focuses emphasis is more on your quad or not your quad your uh your glutes and we don't want that we just want to focus on your quad so whenever you go up just keep this this other leg your opposite leg that you're not on top of the stool just keep it there yeah and don't. also when you step up to focus more on your quad you should your knees should go like just a tad past your toe not too much but, but one yeah but just a tad because when you keep it back then you're gonna focus more on your hamstring as well yeah that's true yeah yeah it was man that was that was that real. super set well <laughs> got me feeling some type of way let me tell you, you so that? yes so now yeah, um after that amazing super set that we had um as you see on the screen right now as i speak um <laughs> here we are doing the narrow leg press and reason as to why we did them close was because when your feet are close to the pad, we get more emphasis on your outer quad and uh, your abductors as well. So we weren't really focusing on our mm -hmm. abductors, but it kind of just... Yeah, and with happened. these, <laughs> since we're focusing on quads, you're super narrow, so mm -hmm. you can't... You can't go, you can't all, go the way all the down. way down. Yeah. And you know, that's that's not a bad thing, you're just... Like you're gonna focus more on that. I don't know what this part of your quad is called, the middle part. What kind of focuses on your outer quad slash middle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but so like outer middle yeah. abdu and abductors. Yeah, but I'm I'm saying since you can't like go yeah, yeah, all yeah. the way down, you're gonna feel mm -hmm. it more there. You're yeah, gonna definitely feel it. Oh yeah, you in feel your it. outer quads. You feel it, and we did four sets yeah. of twenty on those, and we increased the weight each time. And like I said before on the leg extensions, but do not start off with baby weight. And you were eating today. I was, you I, ended with I, four did, plates? I ended up fourth plates. You know, I have not done that in a really long time. Yeah. I and was I was like good. pushing through it, but it was it was it was a challenge. <laughs> I've I've accomplished so much today, and I'm so <laughs> proud of myself. But um, yeah, like I said, go up and do not start off with baby weight baby weight because you need to challenge yourself. Okay, I cannot emphasize you gotta that. Gotta eat. You more. gotta eat on every single set. Exactly. You can't. Oh, I'm gonna warm up for two sets. Yeah, no. And then you need to warm up. At I'm the gonna beginning. get into my heavy sets. It you should be to, yeah. heavy, heavy, heavy. Heavy, 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 and even more heavier exactly. at the end. Like, if you want to see some um, progression in your muscles in your body, you need to challenge yourself and do some big weight, every set, heavy weight, every rep. What did we do at the dance? Did the lunges. <laughs> Your favorite. Front squat. Not front squat. Front well, front squat lunges. lunges. Yeah. yeah. Actually, it wasn't too bad. If yeah. you hate front squats, you should try out. If you hate front <laughs> squats, you should try this one out. No, but it really felt super, super, super good. These lunges. And there are different variations for lunges. You can do um, just like walking lunges, narrow, wide, but instead we decided to change it up a little bit and do front squats. Yeah, so this was front actually squat our first time doing this exercise. I've never yeah, done this. I've I don't never think done you've it. ever no, done this. No, this never. is my first time doing it. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I saw it on an Instagram video. I was like, hey, let's well, let try me, it, yeah. you know? We might as well. And honestly, it's really good. Um, 
It does take your breath away though. Oh my gosh. When yes. you get kind of heavy because it's sitting there. Even and, on the Smith step Machine in, front squat, oh, my yeah. breath was like I was out of dying. it. And we super like, said it. I was like, hey man, <laughs> we might have to. And then like, I don't nah. know why. <laughs> they were like, you know what, let's not. Yeah, so we did what? Just, just three sets of the lunges. Yeah, three sets. We were gonna do. We were gonna do four. Yeah, we we're gonna no no we were gonna do eight on each leg. Oh, you're talking about okay. Yeah, but we only did six. We only did because, six because it was like pretty intense. Because we were going a bit heavy since it was our last exercise technically, and it was just like so, we were just so so winded at that point. Yeah, we um, were. I'm pretty sure if we started off with this exercise, we probably could have went a little bit heavier. But since we did them um, towards the end, we were kind of fatigued and just like out of it. And then he kind of stopped and talked. So, you know, I lost it's a, my pump a, a little it's a bit. It's a reoccurring but thing. But <laughs> we still killed it. And it's okay to talk every once in a while. I'm not saying go to the gym it's and like not talk to, to anybody. But because I, I hate those people. I hate those kind of people that go to the gym and they're like, I mean, I understand that you're like in the zone and whatnot. But if someone wants to talk, don't. Don't look intimidating at the gym. Like yeah. you, gotta, you don't you wanna look you nice, sociable, approachable just not too social. and and social, but not like too social where you sit there and talk for like twenty minutes. I know so many people that are like that. I'm like oh. I mean it's good to talk every now and then, but we need to work out. Exactly. And, and there's a time and a place. There's a exactly. time and a place. Exactly. So it's like it's like once a workout. Like once I a try workout. to keep it to like five minutes. Yeah, which is good, but so it wasn't Not like bad. in between sets though. <laughs> Every set. <laughs> Every set. <laughs> my B, my B. It's okay, it's okay. All right, so, and then our and last then thing. Our last exercise of the day was uh, <laughs> it. Put the weight on top and wait for a minute, rest for 30 seconds. And after 30 seconds of that one minute, I was feeling it in my quad. And whenever you're doing this, you don't want to be, you want to be like, what would you say? Parallel? Yeah, so honestly your your heels should be a little bit back from You your, don't want to be too far from, out. From your knees. Just just to focus on it. your quads. Well you will, but you're gonna just feel it more in your hamstrings. Yeah, we want Which to will actually on our make it a bit easier. But we don't want that. Exactly. We want to challenge ourselves. So you had them like straight up, quads was burning. You wanna be parallel to the ground, if not a little bit up to, yeah. to, to focus more on your quads. <laughs> Um, hold it, hold small it for rest, a minute, a minute rest 30 for 30 seconds. seconds, and then go again, and we did that three rounds, and on my last round, I wanted to give up so much because my legs started shaking, like literally, <laughs> you probably can't see it in the video because it was too close, but it was literally shaking, and I could I was just like, oh my god, oh my god, I'm like 30 oh seconds, 30 god. seconds, 30 I'm seconds, like, I can't do it, I can't do it, I can't do it, <laughs> but guess what? I did it. So, it's all mental. I swear, if he was not here saying, hey, you got it, you got it, keep going, I probably would have just like fell to the ground and like, I would have been like, all right, I think I'm good for today. Let's go home and eat. <laughs> Let's feast. Touche, touche. But hey, you got through it though. That was a good I one. I did. It was That's a good way good. to end it. Uh, that it's one, you're not, one. I mean, we're not really trying to build any muscle or anything on that it's just a burnout yeah trust me if you, do it, if you do it at the end your stuff will be on fire. you should definitely try it out if you've never done those before especially at the end of your workout definitely give those a try and let me know how it goes because it's pretty intense yeah, no but doubt. uh now we are going to go eat somewhere and you're about to see where Ooh. it's a cheat meal because cheat you know meal. um lag days cheat meal leg day equals a cheat meal so let's if you're excited and you want to know where we're going you should keep watching <laughs> and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the next clip and i'll see you guys later <laughs> bye it's the after effects of wall sits my leg was literally shaking for like 30 seconds That's the culprit right there. Put your ego to the side on this too. I was gonna grab a plate. Mm -hmm. And I'm glad I did it because I told you if you, you did. For one minute and then you get 30 seconds rest. You're gonna end up like me after. <laughs> so I don't know if you can hear me or not, but we are at rodeo though. For the first time, he's been here before. Here's the menu.
came in here and I've heard really good things about it and it's packed, like there's a line outside, so that should tell you something. Yeah, we got right in VIP just because we lift and we're like, hey, we just uh, trained legs, so we gotta, we need, we need to see right now. Surprise! Oh my god, what is this? It's a surprise. It's so big, there's like so much. Look at all that fat. <laughs> get a whiskey burger but it's gonna be chicken and it has Irish whiskey cheddar Canadian bacon blackberry compote with whole green mustard it sounds super good and <laughs> so low so low he's also gonna get one but he's gonna get a double patty beef yeah. And I'm just gonna get chicken, one patty, <laughs> and that's it. Is the whole grain mustard? Does it taste like mustard? Yeah. But it's whole grain, so it's like really grainy. But I don't like mustard. You like that one. But I don't like mustard. At all? At all. What are you gonna do when you cut? Don't tell them I'm cutting. It's a surprise. <laughs> I said when. Oh yeah, y'all don't know when. We're cutting. And I'm cutting. We're cutting. But I'm gonna cut. Okay. No. <laughs> they don't know, but now they know. <laughs> just edit it out. <laughs> now they know. My bad, guys. Uh, okay, so, but like, can you taste the mustard when you're like taking a bite out of the sandwich? Just get it on the side. I'm okay, gonna get it on the side. <laughs> It looks really good, and there's a mustard that I don't. Oh, I smell the pickles. I don't like pickles. What the? 